and what's up? I'm Troubleshoot. In this quick guide, I'll show you how to install the VR mod for Lethal Company. You can take your gameplay to the next level while playing with other people with VR and people who are just playing normally on their PCs. It's not VR exclusive. Let's begin. In the description down below, you'll find a link to Lethal Company VR. This is the mod that we'll be installing. And if you've used R2 Mod Man before, then you already know what we're about to do. Just a quick note, whatever you do when you come here, don't click the jump scare button. Anyways, if you don't already have R2 Mod Man downloaded, in the description down below, you'll find a link to it. Simply head across here, then click the manual download button and open up the zip when it's done downloading. Then all you need to do is double click R2 Mod Man setup and click through the installer as you would anything. So next, next, and that's it. Once it's done, we'll fire it up. And in here, you'll be searching for, using this search bar over here, Lethal. You'll find Lethal Company, select it. And assuming you don't have any profiles, you'll need to click Create New. Then simply give it a name. Call it whatever you want and create. Then choose your mod pack if you have multiple and click Select Profile. Then head across to the online section on the far left and search for Lethal Company VR by Adaxes. Simply click it to expand it, choose download and download with dependencies. That's it. If you'd like to play multiplayer with more people, search for more company, sort by download count. And at the very top, you should find more company. Download this as well. Just a quick note, this mod may be incompatible with some other mods. As for which ones, it's kind of just something you'll need to find out yourself. If you're having issues, create a new mod pack and simply install a handful of mods at a time just so you can more easily find which one's causing the issues. Once you've set everything up, click Start Modded at the very top left to start up the game at least once. When you do, on the main menu, you should see that you need to restart your game first. So you can close out of it online and then quit. And there we go. The next time you fire up the game, if you have a VR headset set up with your PC and on, it should fire up in VR mode. Otherwise, if you don't have one, then it'll start up as per usual and nothing will be different. If you do have a VR headset, such as a Quest, you'd probably want to connect it with a cable as when I did it with wireless, it just didn't seem to work. If the game doesn't work for you, check the game's console, which is that small black window that starts up alongside the game. That should give you more info, usually in yellow or red, about what's going wrong. Then you can Google that issue and hopefully get it solved. I had to use Quest Link through the cable and it worked seamlessly, perfectly. I didn't even need to start up Steam VR first. The game should start it up automatically for you, assuming that a headset is detected. That's it. If you'd like to play with your friends, make sure you add this mod to their mod packs, or of course, share a link to what you're working with. Everyone who plays on the server will need this mod installed, even if they don't have a VR headset. That way they can see you moving around properly, join your server properly, etc. As for mod incompatibilities, there's probably many, so once again, you'll just need to add mods one by one until you find which one causes an issue. If it doesn't work off the bat, adding this mod to your already existing mod pack. Anyways, thank you all for watching. Hopefully you found this video useful. My name is Troubleshoot and I'll see you all next time. Ciao.